A forward somersault over a hurdle is pretty much the same. The only thing that is new is a gun, another hindrance. It is quite big, but needed to shoot. Performing the final stage is the manoeuvre. We have to aim at the horizon, if needed, or just keep our eyes on it during the final stage and other relocation. You have to be able to aim the gun at the horizon. What about rotation? You can do it or skip it. Why the rotation? The magazine is bulky and as you're on the plane of the floor it can hinder you sometimes. In this case you rotate the gun so that you could be close to the floor as possible. Of course, you rotate it, overcoming the obstacle. That's the use of it, not as it's shown in the movies, to look cooler or more intimidating. Use these things depending on the situation, not because it allegedly will shoot better like this. It won't shoot better. It shoots the same. The problem is that you will shoot worse. Changing the position of the arm, you can change the movement of your fingers, the pressure on the trigger. As it changes, everything else changes too, and for the worse. You won't hit what you aim for. When you use rotation, you have to be prone on the floor. Once again, the somersault. In Here I move like this, ho. Then try to blend in with the plane. A backward somersault. I couldn't lean on his hand as I told you to, but I used the other one and pulled his hand closer later. Both hands on the gun give you an opportunity to use them. They are quite able and you are free to use them.